EFT, emotional freedom technique, or also known as tapping, is a great tool to deal with stress and anxiety, whether it be emotional or physical. Um, you can refer back to a previous blog where I explain a bit more detail about the history, but today I just want to show you a, a demonstration of how to do it. But first of all, you need to decide what's causing you stress and anxiety. Is it something physical? Maybe you're feeling ill. Or is it something emotional? Um, I'm feeling stressed about work. But feeling stressed about work is not specific enough, yeah? You need to get to the root of the problem. So a good way to do this and how I use it for sports and to deal with the, the competition performance anxiety, I will go through a visualization in my mind of the scenario that's causing me stress. And then I take a mental note of the physical sensations I feel, whether it be a knot in my stomach, my pulse um, is increasing, my throat is feeling dry, all these things are your body and mind telling you something that um, you're not feeling good about. So say you are feeling bad about something at work, go into a visualization and think about the steps of your day or the project you're working on, and what actual parts of that are actually making you feel the most anxious and then you can rate it out of uh, 1 to 10, 10 being the most anxious and 1 being the least. So for me, with my sports preparation, I would visualize the whole dive. And then the parts of the dive I'm feeling the most worried about, I'll focus on them and bring them more to my attention. So this is where we'll set up the statement. So close your eyes for a few minutes. Take a couple of relaxing breaths. And just focus, visualize what's causing you stress and anxiety. And can you feel where that stress and anxiety is. Once you've pinpointed the area that's causing you some stress, that's the emotion you're gonna focus on whilst we're doing the tapping. So we can open up those energy channels. So first of all, we do the setup statement, which is the karate chop. This area here, we're just gonna tap it. And I'm going to use free diving as my example, as I have a little anxiety about squeezing because of my squeeze history. Even though I have anxiety about squeezing, going deeper, I truly and deeply love and accept myself. Even though I have anxiety about dot dot dot, I truly and deeply love and accept myself. Even though I have anxiety about depth and squeezing, I truly and deeply love and accept myself. So that's your setup statement. Now we're going to tap the points. Anxiety about depth. Top of the head. And just here by the start of the eyebrow. Just a few times. Anxiety about squeezing. To the outside of the eyebrow. Anxiety about going deeper. Under the eye. Anxiety about pressure. Under the nose. Anxiety about diving deeper in your cleft. Anxiety about squeezing. And then here, pressure point just by the collarbone. Anxiety about diving deeper. And then the last one, just wear your bra, <laughs> just under the armpit, just tap that. Anxiety about going deeper. Then you close your eyes and you notice any sensations. Has the anxiety dropped? And then you can go back into your visualization and note on a scale of one to 10, has the anxiety reduced a little bit more? If it's not, go around again. Now go back into your visualization and rerun the scenario and see how you are reacting emotionally to whatever's bothering you. If the EFT isn't working, you may need to dig a little deeper and actually pinpoint what the real problem is.